Criticate! Homestuck is a national tragedy. <laughs> Homestuck's awesome. Head to that trophy room. The Homestuck fandom is a is a national tragedy. Homestuck changed my life. Stop. <laughs> you got all your pictures. Ooh. You want to look at them? Yeah, sure. It's great photos. You're mostly great family. Yeah. It's like a Jude. It's not uh, Jude. It's both of you, but yeah. Lovely diptych. I'm not sure how to say that. <clears throat> of school portraits. The laser backgrounds. The bad hair days. Simply perfection. <laughs> Jude puts the dip in diptych. You mutter to yourself, such an unreal burn on the unsuspecting chump, but he probably wouldn't even get it. Come to think of it, <laughs> maybe neither do you. Look at the one with the little doggy. This one? Yeah. Pa, and someone you presume is his sister? Nobody he's ever mentioned, not that the two of you talk much. Kind of weird to think that you might like have a second cousin out there you've never met. Maybe she died young. The old timey times were pretty rough. I think your parents married together. Mom is in the picture. Mom is the picture of grace and radiance, and Pa is just Pa. Seriously, has he ever changed his look? Sometimes you wonder if he was born with his spectacles and mustache, or at least one of the two. He was born with the spectacles, yeah, not the mustache. <laughs> yep. All right, get out of here. Okay. I've had enough. Dude, 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 dude. No more backstory for me, Pa. All right. Mama, I'm I'm in it to win this this contest. Sure. Ooh, look at that contest. Bill fucking snake boy. Oh well, yeah, we can. Well. Seems the power's out. Yep. That should make the trophy room quite the adventure, oh. which is to say not quite the adventure you wish you were having right now. Yeah. All right. Uh, talk to talk to Frendo. <laughs> well, it would seem the power's out. Classic PSYOPs over. What? Credit where it's due. Best way to destabilize countermeasures. Leave you in the dark. Literally over. Not literally. I <laughs> just <laughs> see. <laughs> Ben. Should have no trouble getting to trophy room then. Over. Fine then, Mr. Mission Control. Yes, great. Over and out. Look at Snakey Guy. Yeah, and then do everything at him. Okay, wait. Ah, oh, fuck. Whatever. This, this guy. guy. <laughs> What's he so happy about anyway? His expression probably had made more sense in its original context. That is to say, whatever tomb or temple or whatever that your paw plundered Give him, him from. Give him a tap. Give him a tap. Give him a tappy tap. Tap dancing would probably just agitate a snake. If you had to get past one, which is very possible, likely even. Uh, go ahead and <laughs> ballet. Ballet. You cleverly dodge the serpent, but you're not surprised. Ballet is, after all, the preferred school of dance for such a venture. Nice, nice, nice. All right. No, oh, you I can't do yeah, it yet. Come that. on. Come on, Jacob. Well, <laughs> uh, go to the right. This way? Yeah. Let's we'll see what's over there. Ooh. Oh. This bookshelf contains several of Pa's books, including Pistols to Pelts, How to Turn Sweet Intelligent Animals into Weird Rugs and Stuff, Teach Yourself Taxidermy, I guess, Fuck. and Safari, Stories of Bold Men and the Animals They Killed from a Distance Even Though They Weren't Hungry and Did Not Intend to Eat Them. Man. <laughs> Taking a statement. Yep. Uh, we can go this way. I'll, I'll eat an animal. <laughs> okay. I'll eat it whole. Yeah. I ate a whole rabbit. <laughs> Alive. Okay. Look out the window. Oh, shit. Oh, never mind. I can go that way. Never mind. I can still do it. Never mind. Let's look out the window. <laughs> oh, I can't look out the window. Wow. <laughs> Maybe you should never have listened. Mind. I uh, Look at the tiger. The lion? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> you always enjoyed this painting, particularly because the lion looks so alive. Whoever painted it must have had a very good imagination. Either that or they painted it very, very fast. <laughs> um, yeah, sexy woman. This lamp makes you blush brighter than the lamp itself. Tap dance it. You don't want to unsteady her, though it'd be only fair since she's definitely unsteadied you. Uh, ballot. You wouldn't mind dancing with this lady one bit if only she were a lady and not true, not a truly tacky lamp. Oh my god. <laughs> the Homestuck game has a non-straight main character. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Well, it's, it's kind of ambiguous, but yeah. Uh, go in that door on the right. What if there's a snake and I get eaten? It's very dark. Listen. This is something oh, oh. breathing. Something else, you mean, besides you. Continue. I can look. This room is really giving you the creeps. I can't go I anywhere in here. I can just look and listen sure. everywhere. I believe you. <laughs> <laughs> I head into the other right. room. Oh, 
Just as you pass in the living room, pulling the door shut behind you, it shuddered as something heavy and wet slammed against it from the other side. Probably my dick. You can't see anything in the trophy room. <laughs> it's way too dark. Odd. Rest of house navig navigable. Over. Considered util ah, utilizing flashlight. Over. You mean the one you filled with your pogs? That flashlight? Joey, please. Over. No use dwelling on past. Over. <laughs> Doesn't matter anyway. Something's blocking the door to the trophy room now. Something? Over. Yeah, I'm not sure what. Strange. For now, I recommend focus on restoring power before sunsets completely. Over. Ah, jeez. Yeah, you're right. Okay. I'll do that. Thanks for the reminder. Need electricity to retrieve key anyway. Over. What? Can't discuss over unsecure channel. Over and out. What a fucking weirdo. <laughs> <laughs> Call him back. Oh, sure. Any hot tips for getting the power back on? Power outage seems to grant invaders a significant advantage. Over. That's, that's not really a tip. <laughs> it's more just like, like just an explanation for why I'm trying to do it. Not sure what to tell you. Circuit breaker probably in basement. Over. See, that was very helpful. Thanks. Doing my best. Over and out. This How old is Jude supposed to be? 40? He's 13 and I think uh, Joey's 14. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, test the music. The sound you've heard since you entered the kitchen grows louder as you approach. The awful static is like nothing you've ever heard, and you want to go back to not hearing it as soon as possible. You turn the radio off. Well, hit the play button a million more times. <laughs> it's off, and it'll stay that way. Uh, Rumbo. <laughs> Fucking oh, laugh. yeah, Rumbo. <laughs> Your babysitter has just... Really atrocious, atrocious, atrocious taste. Atrocious. You're only 14, and even you can tell that this is just really crummy. Well, pop that shit open. Pop open. You open the battery compartment. Yeah, batteries for the thingy. Get batteries. Yeah, Jackpot. we're going to be able to see the thing. cells You can never have too many batteries, and never in too many different sizes either. Man, battery management. <laughs> yeah. Load those into that motherfucking thing. Fuck yeah. Another electronic device successfully powered through clever manipulation of resources in your immediate environment. You are on fire. Don't you're not literally on fire, don't worry. <laughs> With your flashlight fully functional and fit fighting form, you feel significantly better equipped to handle most low light environments. And also to beat the bejesus out of any of these creeps that gets too close. Fucking creeps. <laughs> these Although, Minecraft creepers. That's a last resort, of course. What if uh, what if you you turn on the flashlight and the thing in the room was a Minecraft creeper? <laughs> That'd be cool. We'll go back to that room. Oh sure. Now that you have the power of light. Do, 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 do. Now that you have the power do, do. of God. Yeah, flashlight. Oh, you try the knob. It turns easily, but it won't budge. Something's blocking it. Something heavy. Shit. You guess you'll come back and deal with this after you get the power back on. I mean, a big old goofer. No, it's logical. It's a goofery now. <laughs> uh, head into the doggy door. This one. Yeah, dive. Your sweet, loyal dog loves that flap. Jude used to like it, too, when he was younger. He still likes it. <laughs> uh, tap dance on it. Yeah. It makes for a sad little curtain, but you'd give that dog flap <laughs> its moment in the limelight. Okay, uh, <laughs> now ballet on that, cur uh, or on that, on that little door. You, oh, shit. You might be able to execute a pen... <laughs> I can't say that. Pinch forward roll through that flap, but that would be a, just a graceful way to announce to every monster in the backyard that dinner was being served. Like the ringing of a dinner bell with your dis dismembered leg as the ringer. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I guess we're going to have to go on a different adventure. We're going to have to go find the basement. <laughs> yeah. Is that the basement right That's there? That's the basement. Oh, cool. We did. Yay! We did the adventure! <laughs> Yay! Ooh, spooky, spooky. Yeah. How would I ever oh, see man. without this incredibly powerful flashlight? Exactly. Uh, cup. Your babysitter sometime, uh, sometimes cracks into your paw's special reserve, and she tends to do it down here so you and Jude don't see. You aren't really sure what to say about it, or if you even have any business saying anything about it at all. Hmm. Um, what were you looking for down here? Oh, the power. The, the circuit the, breaker. Circuit yeah. breaker. Is that right in front of you? Look. With your paw's strange affinity towards the Betty Crocker brand ever apparent, this musty old junk mainly consists of all sorts of cooking implements, ranging from the famili familiar to the enigmatic. Move it out of the way. Really, now. You can't just tell. You can tell what a whisk is for. It's also in your way. You can't reach the circuit breaker. Move the junk pile. Try and move one box and the whole pile is liable to come tumbling down on you. You need to find some way to get them all moving at once. Shake them up somehow. A controlled tumble. That's the ticket. Hmm. Well, I guess we're going to have to <laughs> tap dance on it. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh, the secret cook breaker. scene. <laughs> yeah, yay! How pretty, pretty, pretty. Yeah. 
All right. So we turn the power. Is the power back on now? Or no, do we you have turn to it turn it on. You already danced at the battle crocker boxes to get out of the way. Okay, let's All turn right. it on. Flip, flip it up. Flip it up. You flip the breaker and... You die instantly. <laughs> oh, she's oh, frightened. Oh, shit. Something's not right. Oh, no. Here he is. Is there a battle system in this game? Sort of. It's just a little, it's a little puzzle. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. Um, strife. Is that, is that a Homestuck thing? Yeah. What does strife mean? The word strife just means battle, like conflict. Oh, <laughs> so that's it's just, really weird. It's just a fight. Uh, so how do you fight it? Do you, well, use the... You can use things. Okay, use the heirloom. Okay. Too precious to weaponize. <laughs> use the food bits. Peace treat E. Condition untreatable. Uh, <laughs> Let's pog do lunge. What? Pog, pog it. it. Pog it up. Time to slam. Slam slunk. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta hand it to you. Tap dance on it. Tap dance it. Shuffle and scoop. Hot, Hot stepping. Steppin'. Does that make me more powerful? Gotta hand it to you. <laughs> Legger and luck next time. God. <laughs> Flashlight. <laughs> See, it's fucking stolen. <laughs> Beret and bop. Beret or back luck next time. Gotta hand it to you. Legger luck next time. Well, how do you beat it? Do you have to ballet it? Graceful abscond. Ooh. Prima abscond, Joe. What's abscond? Leaving. Oh. That's just a fancy word. Nice. Ooh, yeah. a mummo. The mummy. Starring Brendan. Yeah, not a chance of you being able to move Pharaoh Napoleon over here. Uh, speak to Jude. Power back on. You're doing, a, you're doing our psyops of encroaching forces. Over. Give you back light only to snatch it away. Described hypothetical, very cruel. Dealing with sick operators. Over. No, it was just me. Criminy, Jude. That snake monster's down in the basement, by the way. I managed to get past him, but we'll probably need to deal with that at some point. Second encounter with said serpent, correct? Beast Wily. But sister already established superior wily wiliness attribute. Over. Hey, thanks. I think. Trophy room should be trivial obstacle. Over. Wait, what? Add a key, Joey. Eyes on the prize. Keep me in the loop. Over and out. All right, guys, this is the end of this episode of Criticade. Yay! And, uh, and for special watchers, I, I want you to take note. There was a point in this episode where I was laying down and I almost fell asleep. Really? Mid-talking. <laughs> uh, so, awesome. so try and find that moment. Yeah. Because uh, I was barely, Jeez. barely conscious. Jeez, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's very hot in this okay, room. It is. Yeah, so we'll See check you out on the next one. I'm just going to I'm gonna make an annoying noise until you subscribe. That's what I'm going to do. Uh -huh. Did you do it yet? Just fucking, just do it. Ah!